Well, March Madness and MASH Madness are set to cross paths on first Friday, making for a busy weekend in downtown Sioux Falls. Kettleman's Travis Fossing tells us what the increased beer and basketball traffic means for local businesses. Severance Brewing Company will pour plenty of persnickery in the coming days. We're ready to get our butts kicked. <laughs> a combination of light coffee ale and snickerdoodle cookie, persnickery is the brewery's entry into mash madness. The downtown Sioux Falls craft beer contest is about to receive a welcomed boost from March Madness, namely the Summit League Championships. People staying in the downtown hotels, people who want to come eat and drink and drink for Mash Madness. We are very excited to hear how it goes. With the addition of Mary's Mountain Cookies and Papa Woody's um, and the already standing businesses that we have here, I've got a good feeling it's going to be a good weekend, not only for us, but everyone along this strip as well. And let's not forget First Friday. We have a little bit of food, a little bit of entertainment, um, but guaranteed we know First Friday for us is always going to be one of the busiest days. As spring draws near, this weekend's foot traffic will be a sign of things to come. I guarantee as soon as it breaks just a little bit of that like 50 degree mark there, we'll have people asking us to put the patio furniture out. We definitely see people come down and see that activity go from bar, restaurant, retailers, and we love to see that happen. So we shouldn't see anything different with First Friday, Mash Madness, as well as the Summit League Tournament. In Sioux Falls, Travis Fossing, Kelloland News. Mash Madness runs the entire month of March in downtown Sioux Falls. Well,